Hey there guys, get a lot of requests um, from both from viewers, from yourselves uh, and from manufacturers to test lights that are sold on Alibaba only and um, I do look at a lot of them, I get a lot of requests by email, I try to filter them out, um, I think as I said to you guys before I don't want to be reviewing bad lights um, and having sort of uh, you know negative reviews for only to, to present you with good quality products and products that are interesting or unique. And in this case, there's two um, main features that have caught my eye with this light. The light is by EcoSpeed, called the SunMax 8 bar light. And one feature, it's got a nice big driver here. Um, the driver is remote, which is quite handy. It's got a 10 foot or about three and a half meter cable and uh, dimming on board. So all the features you'd want. But also, and more interestingly, it has uh, lenses. So it has little lens uh, modules. I think they're acrylic. Little lens modules over the individual LEDs to direct the light downwards. I'm really interested to see, is, do these um, improve the overall system efficiency and spread? So the obvious upside is that they've got, you've got physical protection for your LEDs, so it's gonna protect them against getting banged and damaged and um, wet and or dirty. So that's a, a good feature. The downside is that by shining through the acrylic, the acrylic is going to absorb some of the light and also kind of diffract it into directions that you don't want because lenses aren't perfectly efficient. So it's going to reduce the system efficiency a little bit, especially as the test that I do is within reflective walls. So even if the uh, other fixtures don't have lenses, they spread the light wide, the reflective walls are going to direct that light down onto the test area. So it'll be very interesting to see what sort of compromise um, happens when uh, you, um, you use these lenses. Where they could be very useful is in a grow area where you don't have the opportunity to use mylar down the side walls and you have to have an open grow area. In that case, it is likely that these lenses are going to be of benefit to you and direct uh, the light down more effectively onto the plant canopy than, um, than a regular light where the light is spread much wider without, um, without any lenses. It's quite a nicely built fixture, um, pretty standard. Uh, as I said, eight LED bars, uh, nice big heat sinks on the rear. They run very cool. Um, it's foldable, so you simply unfold it, attach on the hangers, and it, up it goes straight away, real easy. As I said, dimming on the driver. Um, yeah, pretty much all, all the features that you'd want on a grow light this size. And as you can he see here from the spectrum chart, it's uh, basically about a three and a half K uh, color temperature light. So mid color temperature, neutral white, um, with added far red LEDs and red LEDs for enhanced system efficiency. I put it into its recommended five foot by five foot or 1.5 by 1.5 meter area and uh, try to determine or optimize it for the best hanging height. The instructions um, say 30 inches or about 75 centimeters, which my gut told me was a bit high and it was. I dropped it down to about um, 54 centimeters or about 20 inches. And I found that to be optimum in that it was giving a, a maximum uh, power micromole reading in the dead center there of about a thousand. So I got my trusty Apogee SQ500 quantum sensor and measured in a grid across the target area, which represents the plant canopy. And I took a hundred measurements, power measurements across the plant canopy. And this is to determine the system efficiency. And that is how much light is actually going to reach your plants with this fixture in a typical grow tent scenario. As you can see on the power chart, it has a good spread of light with an average power of, my, of 635 micromoles across the 5x5. Five five. That's a system efficiency of 2.24 uh, usable PPF per watt. And uh, yeah, pretty nice light spread too. And especially for the price, the price on Alibaba is $450. That's X work, so it's obviously shipping and taxes and all that on top, but uh, it's very good value. Overall, yeah, I like the light. Um, happy to recommend it. 
and uh, yeah, looking forward to um, to hear what you think about these uh, these interesting um, special features in this life. Hope you enjoyed. Take care.